game to show you guys. So you would have noticed that it's been quite safe. Um, yeah, some of your kids will be nutters, um, and that's going to happen. But because we haven't shown them how to hit a hockey ball yet, and we've just moved so quickly from one to the other, and it's all been about pushing and short passes, we can we can do this over and over again for you know two or three weeks and not even get to hitting at all. So um, so I'm confident that I've got the kids under control, and they're going to have a look at the hit. Okay. So I'm just going to hit it diagonally to our number one on the other side. So with the hit, it's still a, we're going to start off with what we call a, um, a slap hit. So it's a slap hit because that's the action and the sound that you get out of it, is a slap. So all we're doing, good hockey position. Bottom hand is what is the one that does the work again. Very short back swing and a very short follow through. So it's just a little snap action like that. And we can get the ball to go as a little hit. So just a really short back swing, yep, and still keeping your hands apart. So we go quite good, okay? If you think they've got it, then we can work on um, work on the proper hit, okay? So with a proper hit, I'll do you want to just jump straight on the line so I can just demonstrate with the line on this one. We have what we call a hitting square, which actually ends up being a bit of a hitting rectangle, okay? So I stand on the back of the rectangle, my, hit foot, my foot hits the front of the rectangle, and I contact the hockey ball out here. You might say that's a long way away, that's, that's actually where I hit the hockey ball from because I'm going to be really low when I do this, so it's not a golf swing that comes up and back down again. This is a, my stick probably won't come over shoulder height, my shoulders will be, be low so it'll be above my shoulders, but it won't come any higher than that, so it'll sweep through the hockey ball. So when I hit a hockey ball, I start here and I hit the hockey ball through here, okay? Now have a crack at that, just try it, so stepping back into a back corner, hands together, Okay, so we're on the back corner of the square, and we're hitting through the hockey ball. What this is that they'll stand too close to the ball, and when they try and do this, they'll, they'll, they'll be really constricted in here. So they've got to make sure they get the ball a long way away, so they've got to be low. So what I do is I actually get them to start a little bit further than what they think they should be. So I'll get them to go, oh, what's your square? And they'll go, oh, about here, I think. I say, well, take a little step backwards, half a step. Now I want you to hit the hockey ball. They go, oh, shit, that's a long way away. So they actually have to stay and stretch right out. That's what it should almost feel like. You're right down, you're over that front foot and you've got your weight down. So I can actually demonstrate that by doing that, by making that square a little bit bigger. Hands are up still now. Uh, no, it's, the hands are together now. So I should have said that first before I started. So you've got your hands together at this point. What I want you to do is grab a hockey ball. Just dis dis disperse yourself around the fence. Be about 10 metres away from the fence. And just hit a couple of hockey balls at the fence. Just using that hitting square. Try a slap hit to start. So nice and controlled and then get a little bit of a swing on. Making sure we stay really, really low on our follow through and our... Uh, just hands together at the top. Yeah. So it's, it is, it's actually really close to the golf grip. But we don't have a golf stance.